It was always drilled into our heads, you are a soldier first, you are an officer second, and you are a nurse third. August of 1990, I can remember standing in my living room in, in Leavenworth, uh, looking at the TV and seeing everything that was unfolding, which would become Operation Desert Shield. And I looked at my husband and I just said, oh no, this is real now. And they gave me tags and I had to walk through and triage um, everybody that was there. And it hit me that in a battlefield situation, there may be people who are alive. And in a civilian situation, you would have an opportunity to save, but you, you can't in that situation. So you put them to the side and hopefully you can assign someone to be with them and provide comfort care until they die. And that really hit me hard. And I thought, this, this is how it is. And it was in that situation I thought, this, this is the Army, and this is what I am training to do. 